Welcome to Psychar Games. My name is Dustin, and today I'm here with my good friend Kevin Manley. Hello. And we are back. Look at you. You're shirtless. I'm shirtless. You I'm all kinds swords. of hot. You're, I'm you're rolling, dodging around. Yeah. This man it's is feeling good. Going into everything. So I want to just jump right into something, Dustin. What is that, Kevin? Persona Five. Ah, uh, Persona Five. I just started it, and guys. If, if you've been wanting comfort food and been like, God, a JRPG just sounds so fun, uh, you should probably uh, get Persona 5 because I thought, you know, I I just had a great experience playing Final Fantasy 15 a few months ago, right? Yep. And I thought that's what I wanted, and then I started playing Persona, and I was like, nope, turn-based. I want turn-based. What the fuck? I oh, missed- there's the archer. Sorry. There was an archer attacking me, and I didn't see where he was, but yeah, he's yeah. apparently up here. Yeah. But like, like oh my why, god! Like, why has turn-based turn-based fighting systems gone by the wayside? They're just Peace so out, fun. Boom. They're so fun and interesting. Like, so uh, Persona Five, oh they goodness. they have this point where you get into combat, you, you start fighting, and you eventually start getting teammates. But your teammates, how it's set by default, is they act on their own. So you control your main character, and they act on your own. And you can change it so that you can control them. And I'm like, why would you not want to control them? Like, why is that even the default? Like, I understand, like, you can like you can even set up your main character to act automatically. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But there was another game that did that, too. I don't remember what it was, though. Uh, oh, I think... Uh, 12? I think one of the Tales games... Final Fantasy Twelve did that? The AI healing was so bad that it was almost better to take control of the healer and let the main character be played <laughs> by the AI. I think that might have been Vesperia, but I don't yeah. remember. See, I I just... There's something really nice about being able to control your full party that I really have been missing oh, in, sweet Jesus. in all RPGs. Oh, sweet Jesus. Jesus. I'm dead already. I've been really missing that in like all RPGs I've played lately, you know? Yeah. Because either all of them have gone uh, action RPG, uh huh, or they have all gone different routes where basically like this format of you play your main character and that's it has be- has gotten very popular lately your your souls should be right up here shouldn't they yeah they should be let's uh let's maybe uh kill that archer just roll around here for a second there are many places we can go and i don't know if that's the right one it's a way okay this is where we came from so yes. this is clearly not where we go yes. But there's this little staircase over here, mm-hmm. hiding all alone. Uh, get the archer first. Okay. All right, Kevin. I will get that archer. Oh, you weren't going that way, so I guess it didn't no, really matter. No, but he's going to die. Oh, there. what? You're hiding there. <laughs> oh, you clever minx. Well, he was jerking off in the corner, you know. You know. The undead. As you, you need do. to get that stuff, too, yeah. you know? Yeah, yeah. When you got to go, you got to go. Um, This seems more friendly to me. Possibly. Yeah, that guy. That guy doesn't have a giant axe that wants yeah. to murder me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I, I do. I do know what you're saying. But, I can uh, lock onto people. That's cool. So not only is it turn-based RPG, which I really, really, really do love, but also uh, hand-drawn cutscenes. Anyone? I God, since the days of Lunar, I've just adored hand-drawn cutscenes. I know. I don't I know, care that's... who you are. I don't care what you do. You know, I was watching a review of Persona where someone was saying that they didn't like hand-drawn cutscenes. Like, for example. Uh, uh, Chrono Trigger, when it was re-released on PlayStation, they added a bunch of hand-drawn cutscenes. And he was like, it's really weird to go from a pixel art and then jump into hand-drawn cutscene. It really pulls you out of like the atmosphere of the game because all of a sudden it's a completely different medium. And I strongly disagree. Yeah, I think those people can... can uh, Shove off. Shove off a little yeah. bit. I mean... Like, I'm playing, I'm playing Hollow Knight. Yeah. That game's got some cutscenes. I started Hollow Knight as well. No, dude, you gotta go back. Don't don't <laughs> skip Salt and Sanctuary. I'm, I'm not sorry. skipping Salt and Sanctuary. Don't 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 be that guy. I'm Kevin. not I'm not skipping around. I I just wanted to, I wanted to get a taste of it. But uh, yeah, I'll, the I'll, taste is delightful. It is really delightful. Cause I, I wanted to be able to talk to you about it a little bit. No, I got you. I got you. Yeah. Ooh, oh, in the anus. In the anus. That was amazing. Yeah, that was. You just gave him a colonoscopy. Um. I mean, God, don't I've been say that. Around. I got like 30 years until I got to do that, and Man. that sounds awful. It, well, let me tell you, it's not great. <laughs> Did you have a cold? I have. I have. Oh, I have no. had one. Had oh, a- hey, the the okay. All right, the sharks are hanging up here. Yep. I'm gonna go back to the jets. I don't know where they are. <laughs> did it? Did it? Whoa, that guy's launching fire balls. Okay, you got a shield. I don't have a shield. I feel like this is an unfair fight. Oh, who yeah. brought the shield to the knife fight? I know. 
Oh, okay. it's, it's crazy. I've I've actually been playing video games, Dustin. <laughs> I know it's amazing. I, I appreciate it because I I go I go through phases where I just don't play games, and then I want to play all the games. So that's why I have three games in progress right now. <laughs> well, I mean, I got but I got Dark Souls. I got Hollow Knight. I picked up a game. Uh, but do oh, shows? Geez, do, geez, but do games for the show? Fire. Do games for the show count? Because I mean, like we we have a set schedule. Oh for this. my goodness! Okay, I thought that guy was dead. There's some weird thing with uh, they look with dead. People killing you. Well, I see their health bar, this and I'm like, oh, that where... health bar is uh, the health bar is empty, which means they should be dead. Mm -hmm. But then they're not dead, which means they probably have a sliver of health left. Yeah, the Monty Python syndrome. There's a uh, there's something about playing. Oh my goodness, I'm not dead yet. Not dead yet. Bloody lie, your arms are cut off. <laughs> I know. What was that? that was the wrong guy? Sorry, my bad. Yeah. I'm I'm mixing up stuff. Yeah, see, that look at that guy. That, that guy. He looks dead, but it's because his health isn't red. It's yellow. Maybe oh. that's my problem. And it doesn't show up until I hit him, so I just assume no. See? Yeah. You see what I'm saying? I see what you're saying. His health turns yellow, and I'm like, okay, that well, guy's a goner. Well, it looks like it's it's dipping down. Like, you see how it turns yellow, and it then takes it a minute down. for them to actually die. I think so. Okay, let's experiment. After we murder this guy. That guy doesn't look fun to experiment with. I wasn't going to experiment with him. Okay, so he is... Okay, that guy died. Two shots. Okay, I timed that really bad. Yes, he did. Oh, that guy... See, that guy fell down, and his health was still going down. All right, let's try this guy. Okay. Huh. See? His whole health bar turned yellow. And he, oh, and he, he has a little Like, tiny, just a smidgen. Oh, like, my God. Like, just the tip of red. Where did you come from, bro? Yeah, I need to. I need to stop. Just I don't. Just gotta not pay attention to the health bar. Yeah, just just keep hack and slash until they're on the ground. It's interesting coming from a game like Hollow Knight, where yeah. it seems like the guys. It's more traditional in the sense that guys don't have health. You just need to hit them so many times. Yeah, that's how it feels. At least I don't know if there's some numbers in the background that are. Showing that because there are weapon upgrades and stuff, but it's like, oh, hey, I got a weapon upgrade, which yep. means now it only takes two hits to kill this guy. That's how it seemed for me with Hollow Knight. Uh, first off, Hollow Knight, such a pretty game. Oh my goodness, it's so pretty, and the cutscenes are gorgeous. Yeah, I I really appreciate the addition of cutscenes. Oh sweet Jesus! I, like I think cutscenes go a long way in video games. Like I I'm from the era of uh, like old. Square games in that where, like, your commentary with friends is, oh my gosh, the good graphics, the good graphics are coming, guys. <laughs> <laughs> guys, look, it's pretty all of a sudden. Well, that was a huge thing in like Final Fantasy games when, yeah, especially in like this uh, seven and stuff. Where you're like, oh, the characters yeah. that I'm in love with are really just a well, square think, with a yeah. set of arms, and then I think that's what got got me with Final Fantasy 8. Um, I know it's it's not people's favorite game, but what I really appreciate about... They're not about, as blocky as 7. It, the, well, the main in-game graphics are not as blocky, the, the but the cutscene graphics, they're really cinematic, and I think they still really hold up to this day. Uh, like, there's certain sequences where, like, when Quiestus shoots, like, XATM-092 with, like, the giant, like, Gatling gun or whatever, it, like, right oh, at the beginning of the game. Oh, sweet lord of mother of pearl. Who's that? I don't know who's throwing that at me. Watch the arc. Watch the arc. Oh, I see it. I see it. I He's see it. He's up there. That's that's not fair. Oh, don't never say those words in this game. <laughs> okay, you got friends. I got friends too. Remember, remember the wisdom of. Okay, I have no Estus anymore. Of Revenge of the Sith, he has the high ground. He has the high. He ground. has the. <laughs> We should name. We gotta name our sword. We gotta name the right and the left one. What are their names? Um, I got binoculars. What does that do for me? I'm gonna equip them because I feel like a binoculars should be equipped. What That's if like what they just strapped to his head and he's just walking around with like floppy binoculars on his face? That'd be hilarious. <laughs> hilarious. Hilarious. Can I equip them to my face? I don't understand how to use them. Maybe just touch them. Like Maybe they're select in. Select them in the menu. Wait, let's go. Let's go to the items. They're in the items. Okay. Okay. Good. 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 Now, if I can remember how to do this. All right. Or he just pulls oh, them out of his all ass. Cinematic. So that is a dragon. I just would like to point out. Yep. 
That then is a dragon. It looks dead. I I I I I want to I want to hope. Okay, I have a it looks like a mana Estus flask which I'm not going to use right now. Let's see if this door is open. That door doesn't let me interact with it, so I'm going to say it is not open. <laughs> How are you doing, Dustin? I am doing good, man. Life's been a little stressful the last week or so. We had end of month. Had month end, yeah, that's a that's which a big deal. Which is always a big deal for you. Okay, eats so up a lot of your time. So Kev, yeah. How do you feel about just going and hitting this guy? I think it sounds like a plan. All right. Because the last guy that you did this to, that awakened him. The last boss? Okay. Okay, that guy's that guy's dead for the for the time being. I don't I'm not going to say that he's dead permanently. He's cool as fuck though. Look at that. Yeah. Try uh, hitting him on his meaty part. Maybe he didn't feel it. Okay. Hey, I mean, what's the meaty part of a dragon? You're like, my favorite thing about dragons is their meat is mm -hmm. delicious. Oh, his head's right here. All right, this dragon had a bad day. He really did. He looks like he was turned to stone. Yeah, yeah. Do dragons often turn into stone? I don't know. It's like gargoyles. There was a curse put on him, and he was uh, forced to live in a amazing Disney cartoon. Okay, it takes three hits. It looks like it should take two, but it takes three hits to kill those guys. I got firebombs. Ooh, sexy. I would have just chucked one in that guy's face for funsies. But maybe that's why I'm not playing this game. Okay, I'm not being very... Uh, now, that that's not a bad call, but firebombs are valuable. Uh, hello. Hello there, sir. Hello. Can you stab him through the bars? That would be awesome, but I'm not going to wait until It would be hilarious. Happens. be hilarious. Sorry, is that my word today? Is that just what I'm using? Hi, Larry. Hi, Larry. Us. <laughs> Go to the pub. I'm already drunk, so <laughs> that's why I'm saying the word us in that sentence. Yes. Well, you need a DD. What I need is a bonfire. And I know it's way too soon to ask for a bonfire, but I have no SS flasks. Because I run, haven't leveled up. Wait, there's a thing on the right there. We never leveled up. No, we did not. We have a bunch of s souls, and we never leveled up. Well, the level up is all the way back at that lady's circle of castleness. Oh gosh, that, that's the guy with this. That's the guy with the thing. You're running back. I might run back because I don't think I can survive that without some without a flask of. Well, Estes. I need to at least go back to to get my flasks. Oh, hi. Can I get you? No. That is a no. I think I know how to get you. I think I need to jump from the dragon oh. down where its wing is and then go in there. Yeah, yeah that, see what I'm saying? Yeah, I see what you're saying. See what I'm saying? I have a general idea of what it is that you were saying. So you think we're going the right way? I think we're going the right way. It feels like it. Oh, yeah. That, yeah, that was too close for bonfireage. So you have to go back to the... You have to travel. I gotta go left, and then I go to f uh, the shrine. Helsinki, Idaho, yes. So they said just... I, I, we asked for advice in the last episode on mm -hmm. what we should invest our points in. They're like, eh, dexterity. Um, like you clearly want to get some dexterity. Yep. How much... Was it vitality we were asking for? No, not vitality. Uh, endurance? Mm. I think was the other thing that we wanted to get. So, for my birthday, Dustin got me a bottle of Mitchers, and it is quite delicious. Which one is this? Is this the bourbon? This is just the American whiskey. Ah, uh, the American whiskey. It is quite good. Very well. I hadn't seen that before, actually. Oh, it's good. I went I looking for the uh, Sour Mash, but they didn't have that. Oh, the Sour Mash is really good. It is really good. They didn't have it this time, so I was kind of bummed out. But we got this. And yeah, we this got is, this. This is actually quite tasty. We so. are enjoying it. Um, dexterity. Clearly getting some dexterity. Um, let's get a couple points of that. Yep. Do we need more health? I don't feel like we need health. I feel good about this. Okay. So, what does dexterity do in this game? Dexterity. Is it just how quickly you can attack? Well, this is something you need to learn for. This Salt. is the same thing as Salt and Sanctuary, right? So it's yeah, because I'm doing a dex build and I'm not really a hundred percent on how all that works. Okay, let's go through this really quick with you. Okay. Uh, if you go to your equipment uh -huh. and you look at your weapons, yes, you will see something. 
Let's see if I can figure it out here. Show item info. That's not what I wanted. Here we go. If you look at the bottom there, yep. see where all the letters are? Attribute bonus? Yes. So strength is E, uh -huh. and then the hand is a C, yeah. and the hand is dexterity. So weapons scale and damage based on your stats, but depending on the weapon, they increase more with different kinds of stats. Okay. So this increases so a C is, is better so, than an E. Okay, gotcha. So it's alphabet going back to A is the the betterness. Yeah. The betterness, yes. Yes, indeed. Absolutely. I'm glad we got there. The I'm glad English, we got that. The English like, language is my ally today. All right, the the hall, the wall, the hall, That's where you the were, wall yeah. of Lothric. Yep. Yep, you're going to you're going to run into Jon Snow. Ooh, gosh, I want that show to come back. Uh, this summer. I know. This summer. I know. We're not that far away. I feel like it should be in the winter. Because winter is coming, Kevin. Yeah. Well, that's why they had to push it back. Because they it wasn't snowing, and they <laughs> usually they usually film in the summer, but they had to film in the winter. So that's why the release is now in the summer. It's a lot cheaper to wait for snow than it is to make it. Yep. That is true. That is true. And we got one more season after this. Two, two more, and we're done. And no more, no more Jon Snow. Oh goodness! Okay, I've already, I've already made mistakes. Yeah, you, you may as well just go back to the bonfire after killing this guy. Yep. Sorry, I was going back to Solid Sanctuary. <laughs> Control scheme. That is my bad. And you haven't even been playing that game. <laughs> well, it's it's the same thing with uh, Hollow Knight. It's the same thing with Hollow Knight. You're still using the square for attack, right? Uh, yeah, I think so. Gosh, I beat a boss today. Yeah. He was awesome. Yeah? Yeah, I really like him. I just got to... I don't even know if, know if it was the first boss, uh, but he had, like... He had a, he was, like, a big, giant dung beetle, and he had, like, an axe or something, and he hit the ground, and then he would, like, sit on his butt, and, like, shockwaves would come out on either side. Did he have a name? No, a big, giant name didn't pop up. Okay, so, then so those he, are he was a mini-boss. Okay. Wow, so I haven't even hit a boss in that game yet. Oh, oh my Holy lord, you tricked moly. me. That guy, okay, that... What the crap, man? He's dangerous. He just went, like, balls to the wall with yeah. a freaking half sword. He went ham. Okay, I'm so definitely guy... I'm definitely dealing more damage. I feel good about that. That is good. <laughs> <laughs> what <laughs> the body was moving forward while you were walking forward <laughs> oh <laughs> yeah the, dragging the around. yeah the drag doll effects in these games are awesome look at this <laughs> yeah but it's just funny like to watch you go and strike a guy and watch a dead body fling towards him <laughs> i do like the the memorization aspect of this game where you just like the more you die, the more you learn where everyone is. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, that was that was not that a was great rough. showing. Now I'm actually, I am still down to no Estes flasks. Yeah, you got one left. Oh, boy. Well, let's, let's go and learn. Let's see what's going down here. Now we don't really have that many souls to lose. Yep. But back to Persona. <laughs> All right, back to Persona, Kevin. So, that guy has a giant shield and a giant spear. You need to watch out. Um, the other thing that's amazing about this game, uh, so it does something like right in the first two seconds of the game. Mild spoiler, but it's. See, I don't want to tell you because it's so good. Don't don't. I'm tell not gonna me. tell you. I'm not gonna tell you. I'm not gonna tell you. Never mind. Never mind. I didn't say anything. Just saying. So all I know so far is something awesome happens at the beginning of the game. Something like... Oh, Jesus H. Christ. Uh, he's alive. Oh, that one's alive. That's a different one. Okay. Well, this is this this seemed very familiar to me. Oh, oh yeah. That was... Uh, yep. Yeah. Huh. Well. What I, wanna... I was going to say is Persona 5, the artwork is very gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure that's where that was leading. The the graphic design is just is just out of this world. Well, we just had a Wednesday in uh, Dark Souls. That's just yeah. like that's just another Wednesday afternoon. Jesus. In this place, 
Jesus. Okay. Well, I got my uh, got my flasks back. So I, that guy is a pain in the ass. You, do you have to go around him? You you shouldn't be able. To, you shouldn't have to fight him now, should you? Um, fighting him now seems like it wouldn't happen. <laughs> Dealing with him now definitely is something they'd make you do. Like you have to figure out how to get around his attacks and that. Yeah. Oh gosh. It was just very abrupt. And all of a sudden. Yeah, they do that with dragons. I think that's... I honestly think that's a... Uh, that's now, just a thing from... A, uh, I think that happens in... In... Uh, Demon Souls? Demon Souls. There's a moment where you get killed by a dragon instantly. And I think they just do that in every game now. It happens in Dark Souls 1. I haven't played Dark Souls 2, so I don't know, but... Yeah. You're like, I'm assuming it I'm happens? I'm assuming it happens in that one. Well, you're, you're, you're moving at a good click here. Okay, that was a waste. I dare you. I don't have a shield, dude. Just come tag me. Okay. Going right. down. So, but how about we don't go up those stairs? Yeah. That, that That's, seems like you should totally do that I again. I saw those guys by the stairs, and then I was like, man, I really shouldn't go over there. <laughs> so let me go up. And up was the not the right choice. It was not. I dare you. I double dog dare you. You got armor. I'm shirtless. <laughs> Come at me, bro. Does my body make you nervous? Well, considering his is not fleshy whatsoever. Oh, God. The nicest thing is that it does give you the souls for all those murdered gentlemen up there. Really? Yeah. See? Look at my souls just keep wow. going up. And now he just murdered all those guys. Okay. God, that is cool. That is rad. Okay, so does he take off or does he just hang out there writhing in what seems like happiness? Uh, he's going to do this alley again. Oh, another poor gentleman fighting somebody. Okay, so uh, a bit of cryptic information that Kaiser gave us in yeah. the last episode was something about even though terrible person is there, don't be afraid to go up. I don't know if I have the balls to do this. <laughs> <laughs> that guy is a thing there. Touch blood stain. What happened to him? He went up and then he died. Okay, well, we that figured been that out. That might have been you. I don't think you see your own blunt stains. Oh, you don't? I'd be surprised. Okay, so is he following me? He no, he's going be... in a pattern. Okay, so we can time this is what you're telling me. I think so. So, so he first he goes down. Do you go down first or we go up first? He goes down first. Watch this. Just watch him. So he builds up. So we do have enough time to do this. He inhales a little bit. Look at this sexy man. Look at him. Ints, ints, ints. See, he's he's doing something up there. I love how you get dirtier as time goes on. That's awesome. You don't care. I'm trying to figure out this dragon for you. Maybe he only does it I when have he sees to walk you. towards him. Yeah. That seems like a good theory. Okay, so now he's pissed. Now he's gonna blow fire. So you you trigger him. And then I run. Yep. Oh, jeez. Oh, it's all fire up here. Oh, I'm on fire. No, you, you. what you need to do... Run, 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 run. Okay, so what you need to do is you need to trigger him and run up immediately and try to get past everything before his fire gets up there. That's what I think. So you think if I go up the stairs, he'll start with... He'll still start at the bottom on the he right. He will. He will. Well, you have to trigger it on the bottom first. So go down that alley just a hair. Yep. I didn't see anywhere to go here. Open, 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 open. Ooh. Oh! See? You did it. Easy as pie. My my uh my souls are right there. They were getting <laughs> You can try to roll out there, grab them, roll them back. The I was already open here. I think it was like it was just a few hundred. I don't think it's worth it. Okay. We're here. Life is good. We're in All a right. safe place. Safe fish place. Okay, so things are going great. There's a note on the ground. 
Oh gosh, there's chests. Treasure ahead. Thanks. I don't trust anyone. Yes! Oh, I knew it! Okay, I didn't do any damage to him, though. That's not great. Oh my god, that is creepy yeah, as all hell. Yeah, it's creepy as all hell. Okay, I did no damage to him. He just karate chopped me. He one-shotted me in the face. Okay. Okay. Okay, new theory. We don't go for that. No, don't go We go, go up the, the ladder on the other side yeah. and just keep on going. Yeah, fuck all treasure. All right, sounds great. We don't want to deal with treasure. We never want to get treasure in this game ever again. Okay. All right, so you deal with all these guys. See, rinsing and repeating is what I really enjoy, and that's really just the main mechanic of this game. Yeah. There should be another guy right there. There he is. See, I'm usually not the biggest fan of rinse and repeat, but... I do, I do see the benefit of, or like the the enjoyment factor out of it. I like games where you can just get annihilated if you don't know what you're doing. No, I like that too. And then I do like that too. Or you can get by without even getting hit if you do know what you're doing. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. It's like it took me three potions to get to this point the first time I ran it, and now I'm pretty sure I can kill this guy without taking any damage. Yeah. That's what I enjoy. I do see that. I do see that. All right. All right. All right. I learned some interesting information today. Yes. Uh, do you want me to go on a rant about Square Enix again? Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Are you ready for this? I'm ready. Okay, so the reason that there hasn't been a square, there hasn't been a Kingdom Hearts game in a yes. decade is because it was the team that worked on Kingdom Hearts that was working on Final Fantasy Versus 13. Yep. And then proceeded to work on Final Fantasy Versus 13 for yep. the next yep. dozen years. And then the same team was split in half to work on Final Fantasy 7 and Kingdom Hearts 3. Okay, this is not good. This is not good. All right, that guy was not as aggressive as he was the first time, which I don't like. And also, his friend is being such a bitch. What you need to do is have his archer buddy hit him in the back. Fuck it. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, oh god! Oh god, oh man, oh god, oh man! Okay, that didn't work out. No, it did not. How did that work out the first time? Because we made it, and plenty of time the first time. I think you let, like, I think he needs to store up some fire mojo. So you let him do it once. Okay. Does that mean the that first batch of souls is gone? Oh, absolutely, yeah. Damn. You had a lot of souls from him fire-breathing everyone. Nah, it's whatever. You're like, I didn't earn it. <laughs> Very nice. Okay, I took Very a little nice. damage. That wasn't great, but whatever. The dexterity that I got does allow me to kill these guys in two hits, which is nice. That is nice. Oh, he went for a combo. Alright, whatever. Aggressive. So, yeah, so the, that team was working on... Oh, I can slide down. It's perfect. Was working on Final Fantasy Versus Thirteen, And yes. the creative director, or like the... Not the creative director, the... Tabata? No, Tabata came later. Okay. It was originally not Tabata. Okay. Um, I forget his name now. Yeah. Run, 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 run. Of course you don't kill that guy. Freaking jerk. Let me try something that used to work in the old games. 
Okay, nope, doesn't work in this game. What are you gonna do? Remember, they have better tracking now. They do. Um, the guys in the old game, you could just... Uh... So it's still on fire up there, you see what I'm saying? Yeah, but maybe go up there, wait for it to die down a bit. And now go, 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 go. What the hell? I might have been able to dodge through that. I was trying to take a flask, but apparently you can't take flasks while you're taking damage from the fire. Apparently so. The poison mist. I think you had the right idea, though. Mm hmm That's what I'm saying. You need to trigger him to blow Dragon Breath on the right. Get up the stairs. Roll over as quickly as possible. Now, why aren't you killing all these guys? Because I'm, I'm learning, yeah, and I'm going to be dying, and there's really no point to me collecting souls, collecting when, souls when I'm just going to be losing them, yep. and then just wasting a bunch of time getting them again. Okay. I see. I am at peace with death at this point. Should I look at my... Have I gotten anything useful? I have not. I haven't gotten any weapons yet. Okay. Perhaps because the only treasure chest you've come across was a giant... It is quite odd that they made that guy. happen so early in the game. Is he not going to blow fire? I just pissed him off. Like, I just ran over here to piss him off. There you go. I really just wanted him to kill that archer guy, because he's a pain. Yep. This guy's a real pain. He has not been attacking me recently. Oh, and he's got flasks? What? No freaking way. Unacceptable. Oh, what? And in the butt. Yeah. That's what I was talking about. That used to work in all the games. Oh, gosh. Okay. The so I'm going to take so a flask just to increase my health. chances of survivability here. All right. Now trigger the right. Oh. Wow, he did that really quick. He had just done it. And I can't run up there now because it's on fire. Right? Yep. All right, now trigger the right. It'll be burnt out by the time you... Now go. Go, 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 go. Nope. All right, I took a little damage, but I'm mostly alive. Yep. Is there a place to be safe? Is there a place to trigger it and then... Oh, God. Gosh, he just keeps fire breathing. All right, what's your theory, Kevin? How did we make this the first time so easily? Well, I don't know. I mean, it burns everything up there, right? Yeah. Is there any safety spots over there? There's a little hole on the left. Where? Look oh, down there? Yeah. Yeah, now I saw that. I don't think you'd make it, though. All right, let's, let's take this just so that we can maybe survive this next thing. Okay, so he's going to do that. He's going to go down there. He's going to blow chunks. This is all fiery. I can't, I, man, I can't even walk up there. No, 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 no. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. That's how you do it. All right. You have to just, like, stand up there until you, he, he, it, like, burns down. And then you can go, I think. All right. Tr 
God, what a jerk for writing Treasure Ahead right there. He was a little <laughs> piece of crap. <laughs> you knew, too. You were like, this is not going to be this good. This is not going to be good. Okay, I meant to open the door, not r run terrified away from it. Wait. Now does his flames rain I, I would be here? shocked if they did. Okay. If they made us deal with him again, I would be really mad. Okay, hi there. Hi, hi. Okay, in the first game, you had to be kind of careful about fighting guys inside of little places because yep. your wall sword would just hit a wall. Yep. What happened to the guy that was walking over there? Didn't he walk down here? I don't know. I swear I hear him. Oh, jeez. Oh, Oh, Hi there. And there he is. He still doesn't see me. What this if I can is where sneak? we fight. This is where we die. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna middle gear solid this. Right. They're gyrating on the floor. I know. They're making sweet love. Okay, where did he go? To the right. Behind that pillar. That pillar there. Oh God! Okay, okay. Hi there. Hi that's, there. I I was just kidding, dude. I didn't really actually want to hurt you. Okay, you have combos. You you are much stronger than the other guys that I've fought so far. Oh God, he is scary. Okay, I need to get close. I need to get him to charge. Dude, you are balls awesome, man. I want your <laughs> armor. Can you just give it to me now? Also, your sword is pretty legit, even though it's definitely not a dex weapon. Oh, you have some shield bastion. Oh, okay. Or you have some kill me bastion. That's fun, too. Kill me bastion. Kill me bastion. It's like my... <sighs> mantra when I play Overwatch. Yep. Even though Bastions never kill me, they this I, I, I don't know. You just try to make it work. There's just certain characters where I'm like, w when I see you, I don't wet myself. So you can't be that good of a character in the game. Who do you fear in Overwatch? I can tell you mine. I fear May. I fear May. Yeah, yeah. If you get close to May, you already lost. Yep. I fear May. I feel uh, the fear for Genji sometimes. I fear Genji just because... Some people are really good with Genji. The only reason that I don't like Genji... Yeah. ...is because of what it does to the rest of my team. Mm-hmm. They all switch to characters that they think will stop the Genji, which is not necessarily what's going to stop the rest of the other team. No. Who else do I fear? I fear uh, Symmetra sometimes. Symmetra can be really scary. I agree with that. I mean, I play Lucio, so like anyone who doesn't really have to aim at me is a challenge. Agreed. Agreed. Like Symmetra's auto lock is just like crazy good. How is Winston to you? Winston's not that big of an issue. Winston's gotten better recently. He has. But not in terms of offense, more in terms of, like, being a tank and defending his team in that. Yeah, that's more what I was saying. Yeah. But, like, my experience as a Lucio main is different than most people. I don't really have a main anymore. I can't really say I'm a main of anything. Yeah, I play... Play a lot of Lucio. I would still consider Lucio my main, but like I, pl I don't like just play him. You know. Yeah. I still hop around quite a bit. Oh really? Oh come on now. He didn't get either of them. Oh god! All right, just wasted an SS flask because yes, I meant did. to stab him in the butt and it didn't work. Okay, and then I didn't do that. Okay, I don't want to be here. How is that not hurting you? I have no idea. Die, dude. Alright, no. 
Now just wait. Now go, go. Oh, shit. No. Oh, he started on this side. Yep. You're totally right. He does do that. Yep. Okay, well, I might as well take my flask since I don't think it'll heal me anymore. Yep. And then I have some guys to fight on the right and left here. At yep. least I know they're there now. They're pretty easy to, to dispatch. And the armor guy is the rough one. Him, I feel like you need to sneak behind and stab him in the back. See, I tried that, and he noticed me. I think he just naturally turned around right when you got to him. Did I not go out far enough? No. Maybe you need to go towards him a bit. I have a theory. Yeah. We're going to be balls awesome. Okay. And just do this. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. This is never a good thing to do in these games because it just means like there's a crowd of guys coming after you. But sometimes you get lucky. Can you not oh my gosh. These assholes put messages all around the freaking thing so I can't freaking use the bonfire. What? It won't let me activate it. Why? Because I read message instead of sit at bonfire. See? Read message. Okay. Light bonfire. Oh, my goodness. That was awful. They knew I was going to do that. How dare they? <laughs> All right. We got a bonfire. Yeah. So uh, progress has been made. We may have lied, cheated, and stealed to get it. Yep. What do these messages even say? Could this be a bonfire? Therefore, praise a bonfire. If only I had a brew. Well, if only I had a beast. <laughs> All right, I think this guy needs something. Uh, I think the the third message was the second guy post brews. Yeah, I was I was worried about that. Is yeah. really what I was thinking. Okay, well, I think we we found something. Yeah, we're moving forward in a direction, which is good. <laughs> yes, it is. So, thank you guys so much for watching. We will have uh, more Dark Souls for you on Thursday. Hopefully, I mean, these games, this is just how it goes. Yep. So, that's just what's going to happen. A little bit taxing. But we can make it. We can do it. Make it to the end. Hopefully, yep. we find a boss. Maybe there's a boss up here. That'd be super cool. That would be super cool with your shirtless man. Oh, uh, yeah. Shirtless man. Nts, 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 nts. Looks like his fly's open, but it's like an accessory dangling there. It totally is. Why would you have an accessory dangling there? I don't there? know. Just totally draws attention to your dick. Maybe that's the goal. That's the guy that killed us a bunch. Yep. All right, moving on. Thank you guys for watching.